It seems today that all you see is bouncing locomotives and stuff on TV. But where are those good old-fashioned values on which we used to rely? Lucky there's the times of the rails. Lucky there's a man who positive can do all things that make us laugh and wail. It's the tales of the Northwestern Rails. If you ever visit the Scarloe Railway's terminus, which is Scarloe Station, there is a good chance you may run into a dog by the name of Little Benny. He enjoys watching all the trains that pass by, and out of all the engines he loves, he enjoys Peter Sam's company the most. Hello, little Benny. The engines were getting ready for the winter holidays. To be precise, it was Christmas time. At Napford Station, James the Red Engine was about to depart with a train full of passengers, including a special guest. He arrived at Croven's Gate just in time to see Peter, Sam, Gertrude, Millicent, and Cora arrive at the platform. Peter, Sam was highly excited, especially when he caught a glimpse of the special guest. Oh, <gasps> Santa! Peter, Sam took Father Christmas along the Scarlow Railway. At each station, Father Christmas greeted children and gave them presents. At the lakeside station, he even got a chance to ride on the funicular railway. Peter Sam eventually met up with Father Christmas again at the terminus. Scarloe Station was the final stop for Father Christmas. It was now time to head back to Croven's Gate. But then it happened. Peter Sam, what's wrong? Poor Peter Sam was leaking steam. Luckily, a fitter was on board and immediately found the problem. Ah, oh, there's a problem. Ice has fallen through your pistons and your leaking steam. <sighs> if only we had some tape. I'm afraid we are stuck here. Oh, oh no. Now, how are we going to get back to Croven's gate? Little Benny sniffed around the fitter's toolbox, grabbed a spanner, <laughs> then sped off. Oi, that's my spanner! At the depot, a few engines were waiting anxiously for Peter Sam to pass. Oh, where is he? He's not the kind of engine to run late. Then, the engines can hear a distant barking noise. What's that? Sounds like a dog. It is a dog. What's in his mouth? Little Betty raced up to the engines and dropped the spanner on the rails, panting and catching his breath. It looks like a spanner. Wait, has something happened to Peter Sam? <coughs> oh, glory, we gotta find him. Father Christmas is on his train. Me and Rusty have to pull a train later on. It's up to you, Ivo Hugh. Right, come on, little Benny. We have to save Christmas. Little Benny hopped into Ivo Hugh, and Ivo Hugh raced to the terminus. Aren't you? With no regrets, let's look for me. Oh, why do I ever talk?
happened to you? I never understand why you're like this, Fred. Back at Scarloe Station, Peter Sam was still stranded. Oh, come on! I'm going to be late for supper with my family! Suddenly, a whistle can be heard in the distance. Do you hear that? Never fear, Peter Sam. I'll haul you back to Groven's Gate. I'm a Hugh. You came. It's all thanks to little Benny. He raced all the way to the depot and found and informed us about your spot of bother. He coupled up to Peter Sam, and with all of his might, he pulled the heavy train all the way back to Croven's Gate. They left the terminus, crossed over Renius Viaduct, and passed to the depot. Hank was already there with another passenger train. Time was cutting short. But Ivo Hugh made one last effort when he exited the village. Exhausted but overjoyed, Ivo Hugh finally pulled into the platform with Peter Sam and his coaches. Santa! Oh my god! Well done, Ivo Hugh, and thank you very much, Lil Benny. Here's a gift for you. And Father Christmas gave Lil Benny a dog sized elf hat. Well done, Lil Benny. And sorry about the breakdown back at Scarlow. No need to fret, Peter Sam. I still had a wonderful time on your little railway. Now, I'm off to Tidmouth. Merry Christmas. I hope y'all have a Merry Christmas now. Bye, Santa. Wow. I guess I could say, this is a Christmas miracle! It sure was, Mr. Percival. It sure was. Yes. This may be a happy ending for now. But you all better brace yourselves. A harsh winter will be approaching. Jingle wheels, jingle wheels, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh. Hey, jingle wheels, jingle wheels, jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride in a one-horse open sleigh.